Um, hello everyone, this is um, Tobias with Automation and Controls with Tobias. Um, today in front of us we have the AND logic gate and we will be going through the formula of, uh, of Boolean's algebra of um, AND gate. Um, Boolean's algebra is very important when it comes to ladder logic programming um, or digital discrete programming um, there's a formula that you use in using an AND gate um, you see that number one at the very top that is the gate number two that is the truth table number three that is the logic but um, where you see A and B it all applies to everyone and you see why it applies to why a and B is the input, Y is the output. Um, if you see in the truth table, um, if you have the inputs A and B both zero, your output is going to be zero. That means that it will not activate uh, the output. If you have the input A zero and the input B1 or input B is high, you will not activate the output. Um, if you have the um, input A1 or high and you have the input B0, um, you will not activate the output. Um, if you have um, the input one or a one is high and you have the input b one is high you will activate the output and you will get a one um this is the this particular gate is an and gate um this is one form of programming with ladder logic there are many different forms but um, I thought that I would go over an AND gate of programming logic because um, all of the Boolean's algebra is applied to um, programming with discrete ladder logic but this particular gate is a, a very straightforward and simple and I thought that I would um, go over it and bring it to you. Um, thank you and have a good one.